the presidential candidate of the Labour Party in the 2023 election, Peter Obi has expressed concern over the worsening economic crisis in the country. Obi expressed his concern while speaking on Arise TV on Wednesday night. According to him, President Tinubu has fulfilled his campaign promises but lamented the negative impact on the economy. Obi recalled that during his campaign, Tinubu promised to continue where his predecessor, Mohamed Buhari, left off. He said the president has kept his word but noted that the consequences have been devastating. The former Anambra State governor said, I will give him excellent pass mark. Dollar was 460, it is now 1,500 naira. Fuel was 238 naira per liter, it is now over 700 naira per liter. Diesel was 844 naira. It's now 1,415 naira per liter. A bag of rice was 40 to 35,000 naira, it is now about 80,000 naira. A bag of beans was similar, it is now about 90,000 naira. Gary was 27 to 28,000 naira per bag, it is now 49 to 50,000 naira per bag. The tuba of yam was about 2,700 to 3,000, now it is about 10,000 naira. Now that one busts my head. A tuba of yam, 10,000 naira. Tonato baskets was about 40,000 naira now it is about 150,000 naira electricity was 66 naira per kilowatt now it is about 200 naira per kilowatt you can go on and on adept even bread which is the basic things other countries are subsidizing like egypt small bread was 450 naira it is now 900 naira the big one that was 900 is now 1000 500 naira. Of course, yes, he has fulfilled his promise. I will continue for where Buhari talks and even did more than Buhari. Everything has headed south. Adherence to the rule of law has worsened. Nepotism is at the highest. What are we talking about? Yeah. Yeah, the Almighty God will reward Ame Bola Tinubu what he has done. <laughs> okay. Anam Bramugu, I'm sure you would have been borrowing heavily to buy food in order to deceive the people in your usual fraudulent way of uh, hauling billions into your Padora secret account. Did they tell you that a uh, Adam Brown money was missing? No, it was not missing. Was he obtaining all the land, all the property, government property? Was Obi obtaining all government properties in Anambra when he was governor? The answer is no. Who was doing it? It is the same Sinumbu. Mm. Well, you don't have respect, go and ask God to forgive you. Oh, you have, are you minding on this? You don't need to mind them. The records are there for everybody to see, so it is no matter of a uh, if you like we abuse of you, who is suffering it? It is you, the man who has put you in this nonsense condition. You can't talk about him, but you are uh, abusing it. I'll be last, last, all you that support evil demonic people will soon look in Agbado Gary, uh, Gary Jebu to drink, and you will not even see. Are you qualified to assess performance? It's very, very qualified. <laughs> Is very very qualified. Hmm. What was your scorecard as a governor? No, you didn't know now because uh, you are you the Agbiru. If you if you are learned, go and ask. This is no matter of uh, media, uh, whatever. Obi is not saying what is not saying. You yourself know. You should have told us. I expect some people to say, oh, it is a lie. You ah, Obi, you can lie. How can you say bring all these prizes? But no, you are saying what of you? <laughs> you see the president. You put him there and let us see now because you don't really put your own person for there. You have seen the results. Mm. What is this Malu saying? Are you in this country at all? He said it will be qualified that what was a Ubi's a performance when he was the governor. Somebody saying that are you in the Malu? Are you in this country? Go and verify now. You have been adjust to come the comments on social media. Go and verify. I can see you are enjoying the state of this country. What makes me feel happy is the suffering, uh, suffering affecting everybody. <laughs> suffering is not affecting everybody. It is only affecting masses. All sets of uh, sets of politicians, uh, they don't even feel it. You are correct, but his best is, is killing the people. Yes, he has, he has excellent past mark. The best foiling comedian president in world record. Unfortunately for people like Peter B, he is blinded by hatred. <laughs> Is branded by hatred, hatred again. So blood must flow before things get better, right? You have fundamental problem. You, you breed brain, you have tangled 
and struggled to say, why not keep quiet? What Mr. Hobby said was the absolute truth. Uh, you need to ask her. Mm. Hope you are enjoying the transformation of Nigeria by Sinumbu. How horrible a people can be. Completely controlled by hatred and ethnicity. We shall see who we feel more. Instead of being able to reduce the humongous uh, salaries and emoluments of the legislators and uh, political appointees to reduce cost of governance, he offset to remove all subsidy to punish the masses for fear of being impeached if he dared to make such a move against the legislators and political appointees. The removal of all subsidy has led to unprecedented and galloping inflation resulting in untold hardship in Nigeria. Hmm. Mm. Believe it or not, changes cannot be easily <laughs> cannot be easily achieved. When the person that can change it is not with you, he adding his heart. He is making jest of all of us because we don't need him. Here, Peter Obi has exposed a fallen president. Toby is very correct. Sinumbu has really fulfill his campaign promises in a negative way yes daddy thank you daddy you are not getting to asu villa say whatever you like you see then you see say all this uh all this like badu they will only do set of people like uh the northerners will be say they don't even come and get help some people are even saying they are even worse they are even worse off you are the most unserious person i've ever seen in my life the one in asu rock what is he holding for you or what is he doing for you i'll be on ganu the affect a generation like this uh, uh you know they affect them <clears throat> they're born and born suffering now uh, yeah tribalism have blinded your your sense of reasoning i pity you i pity your people because hunger will finish you guys of they finish dinner now just the truth as analyzed tribal defense against national safety sabotage still sabotage that is it so guys uh, let's know what you think and have your take on this thank you